still live with us on Enterprise Television. Um, it's our main conversation for uh, today. The Opposition All Progressive Congress, APC, in River State has directed the State House of Assembly, led by um, Honorable Martin Miewile, to, with immediate effect, commence impeachment proceedings against the state governor, uh, Sa Seminalaye of Fubara. APC caretaker committee uh, chairman in the state, Chief Tony Okocha, gave the directive at a press briefing in Port Harcourt, the state capital, on Tuesday. The majority 27 members of the state assembly are loyalists of the immediate past governor of the state and current FCT minister, Yesam Wiki. Okocha said that the decision of the party followed the remarks by Fubara that the intervention of President Bola Ahmed Tinibu in the political crisis wrong in the state was only a political solution and not constitutional. Okocha stated that um, where the assembly fails to uh, commence the impeachment process, the party will invoke the relevant sections of its constitution to discipline them as APC members. It will be recalled that Governor Simon Alayo Fubara had on Monday declared the 27 members of the state assembly as non-existent. And still with us is... Um, Cyril Abaku, thank you so very much for uh, uh, being around. And okay. um, of course, uh, this I would love to uh, believe should be concerning to you. It, it, it's your state. Mm -hmm. And um, it's very important that um, we really dig deep into the issue that we have. Do you think, first off, there's anything wrong constitutionally for Seminola Fubara to say they are not in existence? Knowing the you know, uh, across a carpeted from the PDP to the APC, and what they're enjoying right now is <laughs> some form of um, uh, a position that is not duly meant for them. So is Governor Simon Life over wrong with his submission? He's not wrong. Um, and I hasten to answer that too, mm. not because I choose to have a dog in the fight, but I think it is clear that uh, the these lawmakers are not even acting their own consciences. They are not necessarily acting their own uh, minds or hearts out. They are acting the script of the former governor of the state, uh. mm -hmm. yes, and Wiki, who the we puppet know, master that is. Yes, who okay. we all the, yes the, the, the puppeteer himself, mm. who we all know was instrumental not only for their own emergence, mm. but for the emergence of uh, to the to the emergence of um, even Saint Fubara himself. Mm -hmm as governor that is noted duly noted but when it comes to matters of law and um, governance mm -hmm. when the fracas or the hoopla between the governor and the lawmakers came to a head mm. they defected now that was as far as a governor and lawmakers of a party went mm. the party as an entity was not in crisis okay that's the pdp Yes, okay. either the state or national was not in a crisis, mm. which should have given vent or which should have given a basis mm. for anybody to defect. Which that's what the law says mm -hmm. that when if a party has been embroiled in crisis mm. of an irreconcilable um, 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 on an irreconcilable level, mm -hmm. and they and it has pro been protracted, and there is sufficient grounds to believe that continue staying the party could jeopardize a person's political career or future. Okay. That person could take a walk from mm -hmm. the party. But at the time the crisis uh, happened, mm -hmm. Pete, Governor Sim Fubara was not even the leader of the party. The, the leader of the party university had always been Mr. Wiki, mm -hmm. whether as governor or as minister of, of the city. Mm -hmm. So the lawmakers resigning um, and joining the APC mm -hmm. didn't have legal backing as far as I'm, I'm concerned. And their seats, they shouldn't have returned to their seats. They returned to their seats because the governor was in Abuja with Wiki at the behest of Mr. President, mm. who said, go back. One of the terms of the agreement was recognize them as lawmakers. Okay. Not because... That's against the constitution. Yeah, exactly. And that was why we said the president cannot be doing, doing plain politics that undermines the constitution. Mm. You know, we kept on saying this thing. That as president, you see where I come to, to leadership again. Even where the law said uh, the law said otherwise, our president chose to look the other way. Mm -hmm. 
So I, I have said that leadership should step in where the law is weak or where mm. the law didn't say anything. But here, even, even when the law expressly said yes, leadership is saying no. That's what happened in River State. Otherwise, those lawmakers shouldn't have gone back to they should have their seats would have been declared vacant. <laughs> then they should have gone back to old fresh elections. That was why I said the budget that was passed by the four members should stand. Reason being this. When those, 27, when those 27 men said that they were leaving the, what's it called, the, the PDP to the APC, in my view, their seats had become vacant. Only four men were left in the house. Those four men now became the house itself. Mm. So you can, so if you, even if you wanted quorum of four, right, it could be two or three maximum. That's quorum. Mm. Otherwise, those four men, so at the time that budget was passed, it was passed by a legitimately constituted House of Assembly. Because those guys are defected, defected of their own accord. Mm. This is where the matter rested. Now, but because of the agreement that the president went to, the governor went to reach in Abidu, which I thought was inauspicious, mm. he extended the shelf life. Now, he's going back to hunting, right? Because the, what the governor said, it, I think it was over the weekend or last week, the, a political delegation from Bayelsa came to visit him including the first military governor of River State. Uh, Amai Nambo Alfred J. Tespif was, was, was on the team. Sedak Dixon was on the team, along with a number of well-meaning, hi highly placed Bayasa statesmen. Bayasa and River used to be one state before now. We were brothers, okay? If you, for the average rivers, a German like myself, if you trace my ancestry, it is Bayasa you can you, you, you find me. So, this is the issue. They came in, in out of brotherly mm. fraternity to say, so Mr. Quality. Governor, we are seeing what is going on and we would like for this matter to be settled and make it. And, so, and the governor said, you know what? I am, in fact, if I think, what the governor said at the meeting, he said one, that most of those lawmakers are people that he was even give, <laughs> giving handouts to, paying national school fees. Another personal favors he was doing, even, that was even when, before he became governor of River State. Mm. He, you know, he used to help them like that. Mm. And that even for his magnanimity, there won't be lawmakers today because there was agreement in in Abuja that made him leave them. Otherwise, by law, they shouldn't be sitting there as lawmakers in River State. I don't think what he said was out of place. Then the APC in the state now quickly gave order that the lawmakers should impeach the governor. I want to believe that they know better than to do that. You know what I mean? The governor going to Abuja to go and sign that peace deal for me, merely postponed doomsday, mm. which inevitably is, is, is on our hands if we're not careful, all right? But where the governor was again at the time the PSD was signed, and where he is today, at, at two different places, back at the time when the PSD was signed, the governor wasn't particularly interested in people coming to support him to say, let's fight, let's, he wasn't really keen on it. But he had him say at that meeting again that he won't worship anybody, that he'll not go on on his knees. Which means he's waking up to realize the fact that he's governor of River State. Governor Sim Fobara should look at, should look to those who have come before him. Look at the sort of prestige and honor and high honor a man like Chief Rufus Adar George brought to the office of governor of River State. A di thoroughly dignified public official, um, public, public servant. Look at the sort of honor and glory before him in Old River State, Mefor Dekilo brought to that office. Okilo was respected nationally. He was known. He was an ally of the North. He was highly respected. Look at somebody like Alfred Dieter Spiff, the youngest governor Nigeria has ever produced. He was made governor at the age of 23. And to this day, with the reasonable exception of, of, of Ruth Miyamichi, I don't think any governor in the state has performed as, as well as Dieter Spiff did. Because what you call the state today was the entirely division of Dieter Spiff. From the ideas, the boy from Hong Kong and all these places, you, can, you look at the state, it is a reason it was it's called Garden City of the um, Garden City. When El Rufai was asked that apart from Abuja, which other city in Nigeria would you like to go and you know do the same radical pragmatic? He said Potakot, that Potakot is the you know the planning and everything. But you know, like Potakot, like many other cities today, you is seen in this aberration mm. than in its original glory. It is such an illustrious state that we have. How is it that today? We are playing politics of somebody sitting there and you, 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 you will hear the sort of uncouth, very crude, very primitive utterances of people that have supposed that, 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 that have been governor. People, people, you know, when you're a politician, 
was it so crazy that, that, that also I that talked about the philosopher king? When you're a king, you are supposed to be an educator. When you speak, people should take sit up and take. There was a reason why uh, Azikiwe, Awolowo, and Co. When the mountain is so box, it was time for you to you know hear ideas, listen to them speak. Even to this, that pattern still operates in America and Britain. Mm. You hear the prime ministers and God president talking, and you want to listen to them. You feel motivated. You feel motivated. You, you aspire to be like them. Mm. This is one of the. It's it, it's it's part of the you know the the whole gamut of leadership. But today you look at people who have been public, and you are wondering. There was a day, one of the 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 one of the uh, gladiators in this war fight was at a rostrum. Some hoodlums were drumming and playing. And I think he, he, he held a machete. <laughs> machete, machete, and said, I was that I said, governor. <laughs> okay. So let's how, how I come... <laughs> now speaking of this this issue, you know, you spoke so handsomely, you know, uh, about um, you know, people who were there before as governors yes. in uh, River State. And right now we have Seminalaye uh, Fubara, whom I want to believe is um a, a gentleman, you know, a jolly good uh, fellow, you know, going back the way he's been able to handle this issue. Uh, before now, the people at 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 a point, you know, the people of River State came without division, you know, to say we support you. Do what we have asked you to do. But he asked them to calm down. Mm -hmm. He was in charge mm -hmm. and he was in control, which of course gave the leeway for the um, the members of the House to be where they are uh, currently. But the question is, do you think um, the situation he has found himself would have been different, right, if he has been um, very strong-willed like his predecessor? No. So, I, like I said, uh, where he was then... Uh, doesn't look to me to be where he is now. Something has changed. Uh, because there was something that he allowed it to Because, of course, he always say he's ready for anything that would bring peace. He's ready for... Is, is, is he still saying that now? He is not. At that meeting of the Bayelsa delegation, where he made those comments, mm. another thing he said was that each time there was a move for peace, he would make it available. Mm -hmm. Then, after the, after, after the talks, another dimension of crisis will brew. Let me tell you something. Whenever I, I talk politics, I always say that there is a moral side of me that wouldn't do things that way. Mm. But there is a very, very deeply political side of me that knows what ought to be done. Mm. Even if I may not do it, if I was in, if I was in that place. Let me, uh, and th this is the matter. It takes madness to deter madness. Don't go begging cap in hand. Look at geopolitics in the world. Pakistan has a nuclear weapon. Mm. India has a nuclear weapon. They respect themselves. They don't. Is man is even if they fight, they they they, they call it skirmishes. Mm. China and America are having problems, they, but they never go to war. Respect yourself. Mm. <laughs> respect myself. Mm. Russia and America may disagree. They may impose economic sanctions. So you think that economic sanctions? Are uh, the alternative when they know that when, when they know when they know that when, when they know better than to attack you militarily, mm. because that's the only thing that, that you hear when they crush you. You know you so, but they know that no. Respect yourself, respect yourself. That's how the world works. Mm. Until you show your enemy capacity for consequence, they will ride drops over your head. But don't you think it's possible that one of the party is considering not um, wanting to avoid the Hiroshima no, if so, effect in uh, River State? Because, uh, of course, if he goes, you know, headlong, you know, collusion, you know, it, it have you be seen so how, disastrous. Uh, have you seen how people fight in Osho? Have you witnessed it before? I have not. Somebody told me that when they want to fight, the person, somebody would just use his head, his head, the one that wants to fight, he would use and hit a, and, and hit a metal or hit, mm, hit a brick and say, it's coming for you now. Mm. Eh? He will break a bottle mm. and first design, design his own chest. Mm. When he said that cannot, and he's coming to, to, mm. to design you next, you take to your heels. Mm. Like I'm saying, you need, uh, you need to, even, you see, you need to demonstrate capacity mm. and willingness to deploy madness for madness. That is the only time they will sit up and take notice. I can assure you of this one. The, you see, even for Banana, he's beginning to say, I will not govern on my knees. I will not worship a man. I will not do this. I will not do that. When he said those lawmakers are non-existent, I didn't hear Wiki say anything. 
it is the APC mm, that spoke on the which mouth. means that on the chessboard, even we can know that he can use pawns. Mm. That doesn't have to be the one talking all the time. But what, 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 was, was that what he was doing before now? Mm -hmm. He was always the one talking. Now he realizes that now that this man has ch changed the, the game, let me not go, let me not show my hand pick. Let me use pawns. Mm. I don't get what I'm saying. Mm. Wiki was one to always be the one to mm. talk, be the one to but now that he has he has heard what the governor said, you see what I mean? And the fact that the governor's support base has perhaps spread beyond rivers, there is a there is the governor said that there was critical information that the commissioner should have given him. The commissioner didn't give it to him. It was the governor by that called him and told him. Really? Yes. Henry, let me give you a scenario. It doesn't have to happen, but let me give you a scenario. The first thing the governor should, should have done, dissolve the cabinet. Okay. Because he, he, that cabinet is not his cabinet. Mm -hmm. Dissolve the cabinet. So there, there's no benefit having molds around you. Exactly. It, do, it doesn't dissolve the cabinet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then a new cabinet will emerge that will either go through or bypass the, the House of Assembly. There are ways to do these things. Please, I'm not advocating violence or anything mm -hmm. of the sort. I am not. God knows. Mm -hmm. I'm, a, I'm a child of God. You know, and, and, and like I always said, there's a moral part of me that, mm -hmm. that is stronger than the But he will find a way. Those, four, those same four lawmakers that passed the budget should have inaugurated a new, a, a, a new cabinet for him. Okay. You get what I'm saying? Then the president has to realize that anything we gave him was because he was governor of River State. And that the sitting governor can do more than a, a former governor. If, if he had played those cards, by now he would have been high and dry. Right. Now, would, what do you done. think, if this impeachment move, you know, goes ahead, and do you think it, the constitutionally it, it stands? It cannot stand, but it, it, it is, but it, it had better not also happen. But let's assume it goes ahead. Let's assume it goes ahead. Of it, course, see, they are the current if, uh, 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 members of the House now. If governor, that see, goes ahead. a lot of time. Allow, he wasted a lot of time. You know, he's not a politician. He's not politically savvy. Mm. He had his chance to to <laughs> to square his mantle with one shot, mm. but 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 he didn't take it. It may not be too late anyway. But where I'm standing on mm. is this: um, your 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 question was mm. whether no, let it not even happen uh, because because, because if he did, no no no, if he did, yes, Abuja. You don't know what Abuja will do. If he did, if it if if it went through, mm -hmm. if they impeached him sincerely, right? Mm. And the president orders the IG of police to, to go and take him out of government as well, what will he do? He will go to court. Will he win there? He cannot win there. Now more than ever, mm. it is time a reverse must come out. If that and defend democracy. What but they've done that before and he asked them. And no, so now he will not. <laughs> That's I told you where he stood be earlier mm. and where he is now. There's a difference. You know what I mean? Mm. There's it. So he will not, now he will not. He, I, I, I think he's wiser now. Mm. He, and, 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 and that may be, be, be what makes all the difference. Mm. Yes, he's wiser now, and that may be what makes all the difference. Uh, politics isn't a place where you uh, go slow, go slow. Uh, especially when, you, when, when, when the lines are clearly drawn. You don't uh, take chances. You, you, don't, you don't take prisoner, as far as I, I, I know it. So I'll love you in the next um, 30 seconds, if you may, uh, speak to um, uh, the FCT minister. What would be that thing you would love to, you know, tell him, at least coming from River State, you know, you have a skin in the game. If anything happens, it happens to your own people. If you have the opportunity to speak to him regarding all of this, you know, conundrum happening, what would be the best advice okay. you would love to give So le let me... Like I told you earlier, and this is honest, sincere, I have no dog in the fight. Uh, Having a skin in the game is only to the extent that I'm a citizen. I'm, of course, I'm, that's, I'm that's yes, what it is, yes. yes but no, he, he, will, he will share power. Even in Lagos, he will share power. You see, the cabinet of Lagos State, eh? mm -hmm. as far as those who know, know and have told us, the, the president's wife will have her own, you know. Mm. Uh, okay, so I know the one of 2015. Even though Shibajo had nominees. Mm. So people, prominent people will come, you know, nominees. Mm. So the president doesn't take, the everything. governor, do, do, yeah, you, you, you can't take everything. If we get things that by taking everything, they can govern it. River people, let me say this. We are not a one tribe state. We're not, we're, we're not a one mm. ethnic, ethnic. Ethnic, ethnic group state. Mm. The job that we are, Okreka, Kalabare, Bonio, Pobo, Nkoro, maybe Degema, and all these people, mm. 
we are all a job, right? Okay. But people like the Ogonis mm -hmm. are, are all that they are in those four local government areas. Okay. It's not as if they are affiliated to any, any bigger tribe. Okay. You will see the just in Nondo, Edo, Delta. Mm -hmm. But you won't see Ogoni anywhere else. It's just in... You won't see Ikwede anywhere else. Mm. You won't see Eche anywhere else. You won't see Ogba, Egbe Mandoni anywhere else. They are who they are. So, and, you know, every culture has its tendency. So, th there's a tendency for independent-mindedness, mm. if you know what I mean. We don't speak a common, a common language in this. We speak, the common language is pidgin. Okay. And, you know, pidgin by is, is, is street language. Mm. So, to attempt to conquer, mm. con you, 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 you won't succeed. Other judge didn't try that. Peter Dilly didn't try that. Amechi didn't try that. Why do you think you will succeed? Mm. Share power. That's what I'm addressing. You can have the, 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 the lawmakers in the assembly. But in the executive council, share power. Mm. It was not what happened that the governor appointed by four, four, five commissioners extra, and maybe Wiki had been known. And that was what co 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 come on, come on, share power. That's what you do. Share because what Wiki is doing is an attempt to create to to to, to uh, engender trouble where trouble could have been avoided. Mm. The same that we saw between when the crisis began and maybe a month ago. Was not even a man that was ready to fight. He could have summoned him and questioned him. You could have done that, and Sim would have, you know, gone back to say uh, a Ghana, a Ghana, or something like that. But he chose to uh, blow the matter into the open. Has he won the war now? He has not won the war. And I, well, it is up to Sim to know what mm. he ought to do. Very true. Yeah. Very true. And the, the fact that remains that River State. Obviously, it's one of those states in Nigeria um, that is, uh, of course, the economic nerve of uh, the country. If there's one state that shouldn't be uh, found um, wanting in chaos, in catastrophe, that is River State. And we pray that all parties involved will um, have a place in their hearts to bring peace and make peace in that, in that state and the region in its entirety. I'd love to say thank you to Cyril Abaku for being a uh, part of our show most importantly you know make making sense of of, of yeah. this of this issue as yeah. as it were i'd love to equally say thank you to you for uh, making our time to be part of our show wherever it is you're watching us from around the world but please do well to um, always visit our website at www.enterprisetvnews.com like comment and follow us on all our social media platforms at enterprise at tv7 i am henry it will be good. thank you so very much for watching bye bye from us Enterprise TV, a tradition of truth.